Well, the Christmas holiday is a special time at the Lighthouse, and it's likely you'll see someone you know volunteering their time to make the holidays a little more comfortable for our community's homeless. My name is Gloria Reich, and I'm from Kashmir, and I'm also a Kiwanian. I'm also the president of Wakoka Kiwanians, and this is the most wonderful place to volunteer. It is, it, it allows you to help people, and remember that's our main responsibility on this planet, you know, because God is present in all these people, and so you're, you're touching Christ, and Christ is touching you. These people are so grateful for whatever you do. And um, by helping the people here, it allows you to help the people in my Kashmir community because we're able to bring things, extra things from here down to our food bank. And um, many times, these people will even come to Kashmir to the Thursday night dinner at uh, the Methodist Church. And we recognize them and welcome them as good friends. Uh, I, I would certainly encourage anybody to come down and volunteer because you are appreciated and uh, you're kind of letting people know that God loves them and uh, they tell you thank you here. <laughs> the Lighthouse has operated the soup kitchen since 2010. Since then they've expanded to include homeless shelters, a free clinic and preschool. Fueled strictly through charitable donations, the group is now involved in repurposing an old fruit packing house as the organization's base of operations. Volunteers Ron and Nani Paquette described the project on today's Street Talk and Other Stuff program. Yeah, we're going from 2,700 square feet to 33,000 wow, cool. wow. So the main floor, um, they completely redone the whole floor, tore all the walls out and everything, they poured concrete on the whole building yeah. on the new floor, and um, about a third of that will be the medical and dental clinic on one side, all brand new offices, all brand new. They have four dental rooms, four mm -hmm. medical rooms, and all of the whatever they need to go along with that. The rest of it will be the soup kitchen dining area. Okay, so you're moving from the lighthouse down to Correct. there? Correct. Okay. Yes. Oh, yep. I see. Okay. Yep. Completely remodel. All, all new right. power, all new water, yeah. all new everything, HVAC in the building. Taking a lot of money, yeah, a lot of that, time. Sure. All the donors in this valley, I've got to thank you. It's been an amazing ministry that you've donated to to resurrect this building for the future and beyond. The Pockets say the new Lighthouse Ministries facility is slated to open sometime in the new year. Steve Hare, NCW Life News.